the share project was so we had uh, so this this, this like whole thing in, is REC okay talked about it a couple times before where <clears throat> it's like religious education center religious religious education class and uh hold on let me put my OBS on here so you go there it's like once a week um and and when you get older they, they started this new thing called step and then there's share which you do certain projects right they try to get you to uh it's actually a very smart idea when you think about it, it they try to get you to be involved in the community and like do something right and zob uh a couple couple streams ago was talking about how um uh Matt gave some really stupid idea for the share project um So it's like you got to do something to like help the community or something like that, right? And um, we thought of an idea because like here's the thing. A lot of the like Ismailis and stuff, a lot of them are like uh, uh, refugees or illegal immigrants and that sort of thing. Like this is the kind of community like that this is, right? And so they're always like, oh, we have to vote blue and we have to like this is the attitude that they have, right? And um so we decided, okay, we're going to make like a camp for refugees, like a, uh, that sounds bad, but we're going to make like a summer camp type, like a Samsala type thing where it's like a one day fun little event where we bring them home, bring the community a little closer together and just have some fun, right? Have them do a lot of activities they're going to play like Gubbity and all this shit and they're going to play, uh, they're going to like, uh, make artwork and they're going to have like a Bonnie Puri eating contest and all that. And so this was in, um, this was like an REC class. We had, what's his face? The dude, Nizar Gilani, that was the teacher. And Anik Aditya, Aditya, whatever, something like that, was the TA, the teacher assistant. This dude, we walk into class on the first day. He's like, oh, let me introduce myself. Uh, my name's Onik. I'm a YouTuber. He brought a camera and a gorilla pod to class. And this dude was so cringe, bro. He's so cringe. He's like, even back then, this is how I know we were ahead of our time. Because we were making fun of Onik so much back then. And it's like, this dude would, um, he like, he would pretend to be like Casey Neistat, basically. He didn't know back then. By that time, I had like 15,000 subscribers on YouTube. He wasn't aware of that sort of thing, but he was like calling himself a YouTuber in front of me and everybody who knew about it, like Reem and them, they were like laughing like, oh, really? This dude's going to call himself a YouTuber here in this situation? Okay, sure, sure thing, buddy. And uh, he'd be like, what, what, what are you guys talking about? I remember there's this dude, um, TJ Hunt, and like Faison went to like a TJ Hunt like meetup because like we were into cars like that. I, I was never a big fan of TJ Hunt particularly, but he was. And uh, this dude also went to, to the meetup. Anik also went to the meetup. And Anik is like telling TJ Hunt, he's like, oh yeah, I made, I, 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 he like recreated one of his videos or something like that. Hold up, I gotta talk about, I gotta, I gotta ask, um, I gotta ask FaZe like what the hell the deal was with that, with that whole thing. But, um, Fucking, he goes there and he's like, he basically recreated one of TJ Hunt's videos. He recreated like from scratch, or not from, he recreated like bar for bar, word for word, like title, same, thumbnail, same. It's like the same angle and everything. And he, it was like some like trying to be like supportive video for the community, whatever. And he's like, yeah, I'm trying, I'm an inspired YouTuber. I try to make a video like that. And TJ Hunt's like, uh, yeah, sure. Good for you. Like, thinking in his head, like, dog, you just fucking copied my entire video. But, yeah, this is, um, this dude is so fucking cringe, bro. So fucking cringe. Taking shit so seriously. He's like, um, we were talking about Ajaz earlier. We were talking about Ajaz. He was like Ajaz of that age group. That's what he was. Um, but yeah, we go to class. 
we're always screwing around. Me and Raheem and Sahil are in the same class. And we're like, and Mosin, what the hell? Why would I miss that? Yeah. It's me, Raheem, Sahil, and Mosin. Pretty stocked class. So we, I remember he tells us in the beginning, he tells us, uh, he's like, oh, uh, I, I, I want to share a story with you guys. You know, a couple of years back, I was like really depressed and all this stuff. And like nobody, like people don't just say this stuff. If they're truly vulnerable like that, they don't just go around saying this to anybody like random that they just met. And he's like, you know, I took, uh, I, I took 19 Xanaxes and, uh, you know, I almost died. And he's like telling us all this stuff, trying to like get sympathy from us. And we're like, dog, at our age, one Xan is enough to be like dangerous. Two Xans is like fatal. Like that's fatal. That's a fatal amount, I think. 19? Dog, you're capping. You don't even know what Xans are. You don't even know what the fuck they are. People cut Xans to take them. They cut, they cut the pill to take them. That's what they do. You don't even know what the fuck they are. 19? Yeah, no. Nah. This dude was like, this dude was like 19 years old. That's probably where he got the number from. I think he was like 19 years old. But, um, and he was telling all she's like, yeah, I made $3 million in sales on eBay last night. All this bullshit, bro. All this bullshit. But, um, we were fucking making fun of him so much. This was, so we do this thing. This, the, the class was like an REC class, doubting religion, that sort of thing, having arguments. Mashal was in that class. She's a fucking idiot. Like the light skin Mashal. She's so fucking stupid. But we're in this class and we're like doing all this like prep stuff. So we start preparing. We start preparing. Mosin, so we delegate into our roles and Mosin has some role. And uh, it's like Shaza and uh, uh, what's her face? Urshin that have the roles of project managers. There are two project managers, Shaza and Urshin. Shaza doesn't do shit. Mosin basically takes over and becomes a project manager, but he doesn't have that official role. And so I start calling him the project manager. I start like forcing it basically. And um, at, by the end of the camp, everyone was just calling him project manager. So we're like, we're like doing shit like this. Like, hey, that's me, that's Raheem, that's Medea, that's Sahil, that's Shion. Uh I mentioned earlier, he's in the USIG video. I'll leave that in the description. And this is Shaza, I believe. And this is all, I got all this stuff loaded up right here, bro. Um, so we're like, having these like discussions and all that. And they're trying to be like very uh, uh, serious about it. Like this is Sami right here. This is Rayhan. Um, and they got all these people, like, they, they got a bunch of people to, like, sign up to, like, be volunteers at this camp, right? And so they're getting them, they're, like, briefing them, they're telling them what's happening. That's Rayhan. Um, and, uh, that's Rayhan, that's Ishan right here. And so, so we're, like, basically briefing them, like, like, look at, that's a Z Master, I forgot who that is. Uh... She... That's crazy that they were all there. Sami, Rehan, and Ishan. These are old pictures too. I don't think they have these. I don't think they've ever seen these. That's Rehan again. I think uh, we like recorded each of them like saying stuff so that we can like make this final video. I was the media person. And really we were just kicking it. We were just having a good time in there. We weren't doing shit. We were supposed to be a lot more productive. We were not. We were not being productive. There's Sami always fucking laughing at something. Look at, oh, the, well, this picture is so telling, bro. This picture, Mosin and Urshin trying to like explain shit and he's just face palming. I gotta send this to Mosin actually. I gotta send this. Okay, cool. I'm gonna just save that there. But yeah, we like go to these, <clears throat> this dude, Nizar Gilani, like the, the teacher, he has this like hotel called Best Western. Um, he has like one of them. He's like a part owner in it, I believe. And uh, 
we like go there to like do all this shit. These are like school desks, dog. I know this. These are these are kind of desks. So we're going there. We're doing this shit. That's me. Um, this is me and Mosin right here, just working on shit. This is uh, this is like in like the uh, breakfast area of his hotel. Um, that's Anik. That's Raheem on the left. That's Urshin. Did you see hair too? Saw hair. Saw hair. Did you see hair? Saw hair. And that was Nizar Galani on the right. I've had enough for dastardly deeds, Dirty Dan. Hey, baby, sure. Oh, no, no, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna catch you and your partner, Pinhead. <laughs> you're my name, Sheriff Sandy. <laughs> <laughs> They're still there? What are, they, what are we doing? They're still. Bro, this is how you know we were just trolls. Me and Raheem were just saying this shit. We're just trolls, and everyone's still oh, there. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Honestly, who would want a cracker patty? It's so fucking stupid. I love our humor though. Wait, wait, I can't delete that. I gotta send that to squad. Hold up. Just one second. God damn it. Discord video compressor. Eight. What is this? We don't have resources. Oh, got it. And we have a Jamaat that's available. Yeah, that's Shazza talking right now. That doesn't know about this. So the first step is to raise awareness. We want to let people know that there is a refugee crisis going on and um, that there are ways they can help. Okay? And the second part is collect donation items. So say that we don't only want to raise awareness and leave it at that. We also want to provide a way for people to, for people to, action, for people to, Take yeah, perfect. For people to take action. See what? So the second part is to collect donation items for newly resettled refugee families. So talk about how we're going to collect. You want to make notes? No, I'm good. I'll, I'll remember all of it. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay, so talk about how we're going to collect. <laughs> I'm, I'm such a troll, bro. I don't give a fuck about this. And, um, uh, school supplies, you know, home furnishing things, like, uh, you know, like kitchen goods. And I don't think anyone has seen this video, by the way. I don't think I've seen it. I don't recall seeing this video. I took it. It's been on my been on my hard drive this whole time. I've never seen it. I don't think Shaza even knew I knew I was recording. Why am I calling her Shaza? I guess I'm to have it. Food and stuff like that. Sure thing. Do you get what I'm saying? Sure thing. So, um, can you present this to me? Like, oh. I okay. All right. Bro, I remember everybody went and presented except for me. Like, there was the whole thing where it was like you gotta um. Us as a class have to present this to the management so that way we can get it approved, you know? But the way I was acting, I was so like, I was so like, like fucking nonchalant about everything that they're like, we're gonna get every single student in the class to present, except you're gonna be in the back of the class, or you're not gonna be part of it. Literally, everybody was there but me. What is our objective? Our objective is to raise awareness for the refugee crisis in America. Um, when we're reaching out to the Jamaat, you know, we have to let them know that there is... It sounds so... Like, I, I'm, like, trying to remember everything. I've already forgot everything. That's step one in our two-step plan. Uh, yeah. And then step two is to collect <laughs> donation items for newly, for newly, resett newly resettled refugee families. Um, to go help it, they can be smiley as well. Yeah, sure. Um... The, the refugees or someone else. I'm proud of myself for like not giving a shit about this. Okay, yeah. okay. And then I'll be like, yeah, this, uh, the items could be like books or household items or kitchen things. And, uh, you know, we're really going for long term stuff. So, like, sustainability. Even, yeah, sustainability and long term because that's what the smileys do. And we're all, <laughs> so you know. Wonderful, I love it, you're good. Okay, cool. Bro, I don't know how I got like that sort of thing approved. <laughs> oh yeah, this was after everyone left and me and Saha were still there. And this dude starts spilling the whole fucking cereal. <laughs> oh 
<laughs> I told you to stop. I told you to stop. I thought I I know I was trying to close it. I I thought Dude, I you know, kept on going. I, yeah, I went the opposite way. I thought I didn't know you just stopped doing it. <laughs> like you know, like you open it this way and then you close it that way. Yeah, that's pretty funny actually. Oh man. <laughs> That was that was at, uh, Best Western. I still know where it is. Still know where the location of it is. Um, what else do I got? Oh, remember I was, when I was talking about Shaza earlier? I said there were pictures on Google Images that I couldn't find. Now this was that. This was that. I don't think she's she she'll be very happy with me the fact that I downloaded these and I saved them. You know for a moment like this but yeah this is like this for example this is you know preparation that we were doing and that's Anik that's Nizar Gilani he called him Dada um, and Shaza Mehdi uh, fuck wait it doesn't say the full address maybe I'm good. Maybe. That was so stupid. I should have thrown that in the paint and covered the address first. I'm, I'm going to have to edit this. I'm going to have to go into the YouTube studio editor and cut that part out. God fucking damn it. And then that's Shaza and that's Urshin. And that was from this like whole, uh, this fucking thing that this dude recorded. Him working. Like, 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 oh, so Dude, oh, actually, look, 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 over look over there. Dick, yeah. Stop smiling. Stop smiling. Stop smiling. Stop smiling. Put your fingers on the keyboard. Stop smiling. Stop smiling. I thought you were working. Type legit. Don't type like Urshin. Dude. Stop smiling. Stop. Butter. Alright, cool. Okay, that is so. We're gonna say like. Oh, if someone comes in here while the singer is doing this, <laughs> look, look, look. Send everything to me. The lie, like, you know, it's more fun to watch here. Yeah. Good. Hey, no, I know, I'm just like, do you like me? Your news grow longer. Oh my god. give a fuck about like the fact that she was like she had something in her eye I don't know yeah I named it this and then um she got like 2,000 views on YouTube and then yeah we just recorded we were just focused on getting an angle <laughs> And he walks in at the end there. Also, Urshin sucked at, um, what's it called? The I sucked too. 52 points? That's nothing. But yeah, Urshin got sick. She's the most garbage at all this iMessage shit. All the iMessage games. Um, what else? Well, I got some stuff of Mosin right here. This is from Prep. This is him and these are going to, oh, dude. They had a funny relationship. Like, this is a cool picture. I gotta send this to him. Actually, nah, that's not that cool of a picture. 
I think he has these. I think he has these pictures. But uh, look, there's this video, which I uploaded on YouTube. It got like, I don't know, 700 views or so. And then people were telling me like, hey, did you upload a video of it? Like, it's smiley people were like, hey, you gotta take that video down. You gotta take that video down. But it's like, it's what happened. And it's Nizar Gilani calling Mosin gay. Gay. <laughs> He's so gay. jeez. There was a fly. I know you're going like this or something like that. <laughs> you make what? Not to do this. No. No, I don't want to do. I don't it's know what that machine. means. I don't know what that means. You this. Yeah, this is REC, man. Let's, let's go. <laughs> you should take a picture with this. Let's go back. Do this thing. Let's go back. <laughs> that is blood now. <laughs> no. No, you'll kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> it's messing with... I like a glass of dumb fi. I know, it is They look dumb fi. It is fi. Not dumb <laughs> Dada said he flies. Hey, you know he owns Delta, um, what's that, what's that, Air, uh, Airlines? Delta. I have, I have Delta Airlines. Airlines. You know oh, really? I have yep. Uh, really? Can you can fly planes? Can you fly me? Four, four fingers, fly me to India. India? Fly me to Pakistan. Fly me to Africa. I'll meet Raheem oh, there. Yeah. Raheem's yeah. twin. Hey, you gotta have this video. Find me the yeah. gate talent. And don't put shit like that. Okay. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oops. Too late. Raheem. I don't know why I had to flame on Raheem like that. Look at Raheem, bro. Yeah, this is a, this is a, I, I gotta send this picture in there too. And there was this picture from the video. And then this, like we made that into a little thing. But yeah, that, that's, so that was like, that was like preparation, right? For the camp. And then there was like the camp itself. Which, um... <laughs> yeah, we, we, had, we, had a, we had a good time doing that, doing that camp. Um... That's us. That's all of us. This wasn't even my shirt, I don't know who gave it to me. But that's, this is the whole class right here, basically. It's actually a pretty cool class. You know what sucks about being the cameraman? You're never in pictures or videos. You're never in them. But yeah, this was cool too. Um, oh look, Ali Bamani. A picture of Ali Bamani, randomly. Because this is when he still lived in Atlanta. This is a picture I took of him uh, at the camp itself. Um, and then I turned the flash on, and I took it as he was like walking, and he's like, dog, what the fuck? Yeah. But, um, ooh, this is a cool picture. This is a, this is actually a fucking iconic picture right here. This is sick. This is so sick. I wish I had the original. I don't have the original. I, I don't know what any of the original photos are. Um, but yeah, that was a, that was a little, little fun thing we did. Um, but Onik, dude, he was just so, I had some stuff with Onik. Like, this is how he looked. And, like, the, the way you know the squad was ahead of its time is because we'd, we'd make troll shit like this, bro. For the bros. It's because he was all, it's, that's TJ Hunt's thing, it's like, for the bros. And this dude would always bring a monster into class, he's like, oh, I love monster, for the bros, for the bros. And the thing is, Isha and them, while we were at the camp, while we were at the camp, uh, we're sitting down. Actually, while, like, while the video is being taken, we're sitting down, we're chilling, and they tell me, they're like, they're like, 
oh, so what do you think about like people in your class? So what do you think about these are going? What do you think about Anik and all that stuff? And I'm like, Anik's like, you know, fucking weird or whatever, right? And they're like, they're like, what do you think about like, uh, you know, the 19 Xanax thing or whatever? And I'm, I'm like, what the fuck? Because I remember when he told that to us, when he told us that, he was telling us, he's like, I've never told anyone this. I'm being very open and vulnerable with you guys because I really care about you guys. Uh, you guys are like younger siblings to me and all stuff. You're saying all this shit. And I'm like, how the fuck does Ishan and Sami and like all these fucking people who are with me in this room were just chilling, playing music. How do they all know about this too? And I asked him, I'm like, how do y'all know? And he's like, bro, everyone knows. He just goes around telling people. And I'm like, okay. That's fair game, and that's fair game. So I made a group chat. I literally made our group chat. Um, so we had group chats of like, uh, okay, this is going to be the group chat of people who are working on this and that. And and I was like, okay, let me make a group, group chat of like people who are actually doing shit. You know, because Shaza wasn't doing shit. You know, Medea wasn't doing shit. Um, so I'm like, let me make a group chat of like the productive people. So I added the productive people, and I'm like, okay, so how are we going to do this camp thing, right? This like one day camp thing. Um... And I named the group chat 19 Xanaxes, 19 Xans. And then fucking Onyx sees it. He like sees that on Urshin's phone that she's in that group chat. She got a message from it. And she's like, what is this? What is, I can't believe this. I, how could you guys do this to me? I never even told you this story. How do you even know about it? All that. And then he pulls me outside and the principal is there. Him, me, and the principal. And he's like, he's like, I swear to fucking God, I'll take you and I'll throw you off that cliff right there. And there's a cliff next to us where there's a road down there. There's cars going by. He's like, don't fucking play with me like this. He's like cussing at me and all shit. And the principal's right there. And it's like, the principal gets mad at me for doing like the most minor level of shit of like trolling, of like harmless trolling, like recording someone and things like that. But the principal was like, oh, Anik is going to like threaten your life. Like, repeatedly, back-to-back, back, and, like, assert, like, physical dominance over you and try to intimidate you? Oh, hey, okay, totally fine, totally fine. What a fucking, like, lunatic. Everyone knew about it. And the thing is, like, the way on it, like, he made YouTube videos, right? So we'd always make fun of his YouTube videos. So, like, this was, he deleted all of them. Shocker, right? Oh, the mini vlog, like, I hate when people make videos like this. Like, they think they're so special. They think they're so... Especially, they think they have so much to offer to the world. They really don't. They really don't have shit going on. And so we would comment on his posts. Like, thanks for the inspiration, bro. Keep up that video quality. I know you low-key keeping it hunted. This is so motivational. I almost cried. I can't wait to continue to watch your vlogs. By the way, how's that eBay thing going? I really want to buy some lanyards because I am kind of lost mine. Anyways, you're legit like Anki Johnson or Robert Green. Best motivational speaker right here, boy. I can't wait to see all eight of those cars. Yeah, he said he had eight cars. He literally told us, he's like, yeah, I have eight cars. Can't wait to see all those eight cars. Winky face. Shout out to Cher, shout out to Dada, shout out to Ali Bumani, shout out to Nair's amazing plain impression performance in most of the music video. I have to show that. I already did show that, but I didn't show the green screen of it. Um, And then I like put this underneath it. It's so stupid. This is so stupid. But we were memeing, bro. We were memeing. Making 9-11 jokes to Muslims is like the funniest thing ever. Hey yo, I want to thanks for all the inspiration. I can't find your eBay. I watch your vlogs, but I would sure like that. 5% off. He said in the video, he's like, oh, check link for my eBay. This is an eBay. Shit's fire. I just shazam that shit. Just to, I only watched like the first like 30 seconds. And then I'm like, all right, cool. That tells me everything I need to know to roast this guy. I didn't actually watch his videos. It's boring as fuck. Waking up at 2 a.m. to vlog for us. Can't wait for your project part two. Exclamation mark one exclamation mark. Um, look at this. <laughs> I'm Teros Zoyeb Harasqui. It's a uh, fucking like. Oh, damn. I wish I. Oh, there were, I don't think there were any comments on this one. Love your best friend who I'm voting for. Um, and then Sal sent me this. He's like, bruh, he's talking to himself. We found out that both of these accounts were from him. Both of these accounts were his. He owned multiple accounts, and he would just, I feel you when it comes to depression, hit me hard for you, he's recently caught out of it. 
thanks man, depression isn't okay, we all need to get together and help people out of it. Like the most basic, generic, like, I, what prompts you to even say these words? Oh, this shit fire about true, preach. This picture's amazing. This picture's amazing. I love this picture. <laughs> Can't look them, bro. We should block them. Just get that cash bank. Well, at least you got the three million from eBay. When well, we on the come up, it's real nigga hours. <laughs> bro, we were just trolling. That's all we would do. And then he would send me. Oh, wait. I should put this into. I should put this into paint so I don't dox this guy. Give me one second. Ah, oh, fuck it. I'm, I, I'm gonna have to edit this anyways. I'll edit it out anyways. But yeah, he'd be like, I'd send the flyer and he'd be like, call now ASAP, you're late for class. I know. Or he'd be like, I'd always do some dumb shit. You're forgiven, but try to learn from this. Research this, then show me what you've learned. But now, but no, you are forgiven. And I would send him this fucking, like some CM shit. You need to send the video out real quick. I remember, like, he'd make vlogs and they'd be very basic. So, Faison decided to record one time while we were at Nara's house, and look what he made. What's up, guys? Onik brand new vlog. What's up, guys? Onik here. So, I got an inspirational vlog with my students. <laughs> uh, he's my student, you know. You know, he took, he tried to take 18. I think we were geeked the fuck out in this, maybe. Yeah, I just, no, fuck you. 18. 18. He took 18 Xanaxes. Not 19, though, not 19. Yeah, 19's overdosing, but. Yeah. Oh, that's another one I stood in. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's, uh, <laughs> oh, I got a whole class here. Uh, sir, no laughing in class, please. Okay, so back to the inspirational video. Yeah. All right, so I, I got a vlog coming up soon. <laughs> you know, I got my, uh, I didn't copy teaching hard at all, you know. My, uh, keep cruising forward. It's not cheating how to keep moving forward. Not at all, man. Yeah, that was oh, it. That was uh, it. Landscape mode. Landscape. Oh, yeah. You have to keep the vlog landscape, dude. Yeah, from the vlog um, landscape thing. Uh, so, uh, motivation, you know. I've, oh, been, yeah. you've been, I've been through a lot of stuff in my life lately, you know. You yeah. know, um, you know, just stuff vaguely. Yeah. Been through a lot of stuff. Like a lot of, like, Xanaxes. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knew. My eBay business is going pretty. <laughs> Everyone knew. Xanaxes. <laughs> but I mean, my eBay business is going pretty good. <laughs> three million. Nigga, no. probably three million Eight cars. Nigga probably <laughs> sold three Bugattis. <laughs> <laughs> All right. TJ has like a little like thing. It's called keep moving forward. Like it's a little motivational thing, right? You know yeah. What he does. And, and he has the yeah. for the bro. <laughs> Dude, this is so stupid. This is so stupid. We were making fun. We were ahead of our time. We were straight up ahead of our oh, time. Monster. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, I was doing monster every day, no, dude, no. for the bros. I don't know. Like, literally, I think he copied TJ Hunt. He was like, yeah, I keep cruising for it. And TJ Hunt was like, wait, this is copy. He was like, yeah, yeah, good idea, man, good idea. And I could see TJ Hunt's expression. He was like, uh, I think you copied my idea, bro. <laughs> and dude, TJ Hunt was holding like 30 cans of monster because everybody was giving him monsters. Yeah. Oh my. It's your really? tradition, dude, because he's a drink of monster. Dude, Jaden McDonald is retarded. Huh? Oh, we gotta talk about Jaden McDonald. It's, it's, it's for the bros, dude. It's that's for, so stupid. for the bros. And that's why they gave it to him? Yeah, like every time we buy meetup, like, this is a meetup, he used to give it to him. Now he's not drinking him. Yeah, he stopped drinking him. Now he's addicted to Xana. <laughs> yeah, that was a, that was a fun little... That was a fun little thing. That's pretty much it for the share project.